I, I live for, for some raw Madden. Now I have to ask you because you have me going down, you know, the rabbit's hole for you. And I know you've been to a lot of playoff games the last couple of years. So what's the best Niner playoff game you've ever been to? Well, I've only been to a few. 2019. Since 2019. I hadn't gone to any playoff games before that. I never really? got to go to the Candlestick playoff games. You know, unfortunately, circumstances... Your little broke kid. I watched no, all those so games. Good. I, I watched all those games. No, no, no. It, it doesn't mean anything to me. Okay. If the, whether or not I was at the game or not. Yeah, no, no harm, no foul. Mm -hmm. Because I remember those games like I was there. Yeah. I basically was at those games yeah, for sure through the TV. My mom used to say, "Boy, you're really at the game." I'd sit in front of the TV, <laughs> tennis TV, five feet away from the screen, locked in on every graphic, yeah. locked in on every commercial, locked in on every little factoid and stat, just sitting there quietly as a kid by myself watching all those big games. And I remember all the calls with Matt and Silverall. But since I've been going since 2019, we've had the Minnesota game. We've had the Green Bay game. The Seahawks game. The Cowboy game. Probably my favorites. Probably my favorites. But I got a, I got a short history. And okay. I'm creating these memories now with Anna, who's now been coming to these yeah. playoff games. And to hear her excitement about this Saturday. It's like, babe, I'm really fired up for this game. I'm really psyched up for That's this game. That's cool. And I'm like, I got her. And then baby Chaz is walking around, Papa, I, I want to wear my Niner jersey. Papa, I want to wear my Niner jersey. Her. Like, you know what I'm saying? By the way, I'm going to read this. We the Faithful, he spent $19.99. Thanks for the $20, We the Faithful. Defense make them one-dimensional turnovers and sacks will come. Offense find a mismatch and exploit it. But we're going to hit them in our mouth and make them pick their lip up all game long. All that taco is going to get them zipped up 38-10. to 10. That's from We the Faithful. He's picking a 38-10 to 10 game. All right. Uh, I think the Niners are going to win big what, what, going away. What, what's your favorite playoff game? It's got to be the it's got to be the NFC title game with the Niners and Cowboys. Uh, no, that's actually not. Even though that's one of because I was so young, like I was thirteen years old or twelve years old or whatever. I was with my dad and my grandpa. Was, Saints Niners. To me, if I were to rank them one, two, three in order, it goes Saints Niners number one. It just in terms of like yeah. the 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 jubilation and the entirety of the game, the actual right. game and the feeling and and coming out of that stadium and everything. Mm -hmm. Saints Niners, just because I, I literally was crying, and the entire stadium stood the entire time. Saints right. Niners, one of the greatest games of all time yep. in Bay Area history. And then number two, Giants Niners, the mm. wild card game. Unbelievable. Me and Mikey C sitting in the end zone talking smack to New York Giants fans. Just unbelievable game. The, the comeback was unreal. And then number three is the Kaepernick game yeah. at Candlestick because just the way that game unfolded and to beat Green Bay after not yep. beating them for so long and to see Kaepernick do yep. that in his first playoff game, it was unreal. Not knowing in real time and now in retrospect looking back, not knowing it was the final playoff game yeah. in Candlestick, mm -hmm. that entire build up to it, the tailgate, everything. For me, these are my personal right. ones. Yeah, that's the one. Those yeah. are the ones. That, that was a, that I've been, was a I've been I think I've been to <clears throat> eleven or twelve playoff games. I've been very lucky. Yeah. No, I can't wait to go to this one. But yeah, all, all the playoff games I've been to has been in the last last five years. Last five years. Um Luckily, I got into this business to get some credentials well, or whatnot. So uh, it's been a lot of fun. 888-957-9570. Real quick, Shasky. Shameless shout out to yep. 745. Also, don't forget, between 730 and 830, you want to win an autographed throwback Christian McCaffrey jersey? Well, listen for the key words in about eight minutes. We'll do it for an hour. Starting at 730 to 830, listen for the key words and text that keyword to 20357, and you will qualify for an autograph throwback. Chris McCaffrey jersey. You also listen between 12.30 and 1.30 and 4.30 to 5.30. You can win, and yes, you can qualify once each show. We've had over 10,000 text messages. Wow. Over wow. 10,000 text messages. People want this jersey. Wow. Bad. That's crazy. Wow, that's crazy. Uh, yeah, they do want this CMC jersey. It's similar to the one I've got on right now, Steve Young. Yep. It's a 94, you know, retro throwback. Mm -hmm. uh, but um, the one thing that that sucks about the digital age. I know the digital has, you know, having a phone and everything and, and not having to have physical copy tickets. Yes. Yeah. So I was going back. My, my brother dropped off a bunch of stuff uh, at the house yep. recently, a bunch of old, you know, sports illustrated and things like that. And I had some tickets that he had somehow gotten a hold of that were mine. And I'd gone back and I was looking at all of my tickets from back in the day. And I don't even remember this game. I don't even remember, but I was there. I have the ticket stub. The final game for LT in 1993, it was like January of 94. Oh, Ricky Waters ran for five touchdowns that They day. won like 44 to 3. So I watched three. that game back yeah. recently after seeing yeah. it. Because I don't even remember that Dan game. Reeves, Dan Reeves was the head coach yes. of the New York Giants. 
Phil Sims on the field. Ricky Waters ran for five touchdowns. And LT retired on the yeah. on the field at yeah. the end of the game. Yep. I don't even remember that yeah, game. Yeah, oh, I remember that game. But I, I didn't. That game. I and I went to the game and I didn't. Well, I, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, right, I don't right, even. Right, right, right. For whatever reason, it got blocked in all of the yeah. memories right. and whatnot. And I had a ticket stub. I'm saying, damn. So that's why, like, if you get a chance to take your family member to, you get to bring Anna to the yep. game, your daughter to the game. These are memories that forge a fandom for mm -hmm. life. Mm -hmm. For life. And you're going to go back and. and it's it's going to make you addicted to the sport and to the team forever. Yeah, now for her to, you know, we've because Anna likes to get there right on time, but we've got there early a couple times. She goes, oh, we need to get here early all the time. They'll warm it up and on the field, the, the music playing and all that stuff, and the bomber jet flying over the stadium. And, of course, with Brock Purdy, when he was struggling during the bye week, or excuse me, during that three-game losing streak, she was stressed out. She called me and goes, this is why women live longer than men. Yeah. We don't watch sports. <laughs> I'm stressed out right now. I'm getting, going crazy. What's wrong with Brock? He's got a concussion. Ah! And I was like, that's a fan. That's a fan right there. But, you know, one of the, fun, the best tickets I have when you talk about ticket stubs is the Rose Bowl. Kove and I, Ryan oh, Kove, nice. drove down to the Rose Bowl, Florida State, Oregon, uh, the first ever BC, uh, playoff, playoff game in college football. And we got a scalper. We bought some tickets from a scalper. And they had the rose petal on the ticket. That's cool as hell. the rose petal. Yeah, that's cool as hell. So I was like, man, I got to keep and this. As much as I love the digital age, that, right. you're not comparing to that. No, it doesn't. You're just not. And so I have a book, B. I, I bought like a binder, you yeah. know, one of those right, school right. binders, a yep. black one. I got this binder and I put it into all my tickets in right. there. And I'll, one of these days I'll bring it in. We'll go through them all. Yeah, not There yet. are hundreds of games I've been to.